one inches of water column or less on your return pathway, use a barometric relief damper. If you're between 0.1 and 1, use exhaust fan. And if you're greater than 1, use a return fan economizer. I won't read them all, but there are some important ones. Obviously, the lowest first cost is going to be trick relief. The exhaust fan's a lower first cost than the return fan. And the return fan is the highest first cost, uh, but is able to cover the larger return pathway drops. So good resource here for a rule of thumb chart. Um, I'm sure we'll share this with anybody who's interested. Okay, so let's have some fun. Trivia. What is this? This is a sling psychrometer. And I like to throw in here, what speed do we have to spin this sling psychrometer at in order to get an accurate wet bulb reading? 